you know, he never played his game because of the, I mean, the accomplishments or anything or the recognition you play because you love. And I think when you respect the game, you work hard, sometimes things happen organically. And when she called me and told me the news, I was literally in shock a little bit. Very honored and grateful for this recognition. But I was just really excited to see these girls. I'm like, I've played, had so many battles with these women, you know, so many memories and stuff. For me, I was just like, I wanted to just catch up and see people, give some hugs out. For me, it's always surreal, you know, like my goal coming in was just to make a team, let alone, you know, just survive through training camp. Like, I'm gonna play good enough, hard enough that you're not gonna cut me today. And obviously it turned into 16 years. And so whenever I get a phone call like that, it's, to me, it's just like, wow. Varsity jackets are like becoming in again, but to be able to have the patches, the Seattle Storm, the Commissioner Cup on the inside to have more of my accomplishments, it's just like a subtle way of kind of you know, realizing what I've done in this league so far. The jack is, is obviously, it's real, but it's also symbolic because it's just shown me, you know, the journey up until this point. But most especially, like, I see my jacket, you know, next to Tisha's, and I see my jacket next to Sue, you know. I think it especially hit home with a lot of what I experienced this summer, you know, with my injury and just trying to get back on my two feet. So for her to call and to tell me that I had made that, I kind of went back to 2016 when they had the 20. It was a season that was really special. And so for me to kind of tap into that memory, it brought a lot of gratitude and joy to my heart. You know, Kathy was there for a game. She was in the hotel lobby. I said, Katie, can I talk to you? That's when Kathy's like, I wanted to tell you that um, we made the W25. Being in the W and coaching and, and everything has been fun to kind of stay connected to some of the, the current and the folks that are playing. But I mean, Coop and just those, just like you do, you watch. I keep track of everybody. I swim down New Orleans, Coop's in college, like Lisa's the big three and everything else that she's doing commercials. And like you just, you, you always are connected and supporting and, and pulling for each other. It is fun to, to kind of have face to face and just see how life not just your work, but like family, everything is like, yo, how, how are you? It's just a respect and like kind of brings back memories too. Like you just kind of reminisce like, yo, I did this for a long time. You're like, did I? You, know, you always play for, for your family, play for your friends, but then you realize you represent the city, you represent a franchise, you represent a league, a league that started 25 years ago. And to see the growth, uh, it's so amazing. Uh, and when you put that jacket on, it's, it's just like reality. It's like, okay, I already did all of that, but the league is still growing and there's so much to still to do. So it's just like a little bit of a proud moment that you just take. Mm -hmm.